Hey guys, is that too close? What about now? <sighs> Mustache drop. Welcome to the show. We are about to start one of the harder workouts. We're doing about three of these a week. Uh, if you guys haven't heard, this is called the Clydesdale Project. We're basically going for that 230 mark at 200 plus pounds. As you can see, I'm a big boy, but I got big dreams too. So, I got my mustache, because Mustache May is coming down. And, you know, basically, we're gonna take these next couple months and we're really gonna put the work in. And I've got a great team of athletes up here supporting me for training camp. Oliver's on the other side of the camera right now. Today is going to be your guys' first experience of seeing what speed work leading up for a huge event like this is, long distance speed. Today's effort is going to be two sets of 10 400s, so 10 of them with 60 seconds rest in between each one at about 5K pace, rest three to five minutes, and then we're going to repeat that again. And right now, you may not notice this, but uh, we're at Rim of the World High School at 6,000 feet in the sky, so just understand that that's probably about three seconds a mile or so slower than you'd normally be experiencing just because of less oxygen up here. Um, and it's a little bit windy today, which is nice just to have the cool breeze, but definitely it, it all makes an effect. So today we're probably gonna aim for 75s to 85s, every single 400. You know, 75 seconds is a five minute pace, 85 seconds is a 540 pace. So we'll start out the first 10, kind of in that open area towards the higher end. And then if we're looking strong and feeling good, we're gonna drop it down to the 75s. And uh, we got Alex and Luca. Woo! Uh, Alex is is the old man champ of uh, High Rocks. Love this guy. Uh, uh, uh. You should see him, he's the champ of the toilet now. I am. About three. Gosh. Full smash. The noise is coming out of there. It was like apocalypse now. Just it's good. war. I'll be honest, like, I don't think it's kind of fair to have these shoes that have this, this bonus power in it, but because everybody's using them and I'm planning on racing in one of them, I'm going to use it. It's the new frontier of running. If I had to say from like a moral standpoint, I don't think it's cool because basically now it's not how fast you can run, it's like how well you can science the situation. Like ideally right now I would have like the perfect drink, I would have the perfect shoes on, I would have the heart rate monitor on. And that stuff's all that, an opportunity for you, but in reality, the reason why I love running so much is it's a sport where you just need a pair of shoes and a good attitude and some hard effort and you can be a champion of it. You know, it's not like a gear based sport, but now it's becoming a gear based sport, which I think is for pussies. But um, that all being said, I'm definitely running on these things because I'll take the advantage where it is. Um, a shred. That takes us down just sub 540. Woo! We'll Easy water. Yeah. Defense. Oh, awesome? <laughs> I think I'll take the inside. You want it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. All right. We did that one. 121. Ouch. Keeping 540 pace. My lungs are great from CrossFit and biking a shit ton, but and like running for sure. But speed reps, it's just like high intensity, you know, CrossFit, but just for your hamstrings, your hip flexors, and your calves. It works your lungs, obviously, but you need to build that muscle memory and economy. You do it by the end of these speed sessions, I'm cooked.
The sets aren't as bad on your lungs, but the lactic acid after like rep six or seven, it's just there and doesn't want to go. It just stays, stays, and stays. And I'm working with Ryan Hall right now, so he obviously has a ton of experience in this. And we're working with him just to find out what it's like merging size and speed. He's a giant now. And he's super fucking fast. I always heard about the, the 20 by 400 workout. I've never done it myself. We're doing a little split of rest in between. But I like, remember when I was racing against guys like Max King, who's a savage. You should look him up if you don't know about him. So yeah, I think this will all stack up. This may be the fastest I've ever been in my life by the end of this thing, so I'm quite excited. Patch is a hula hand that hurts. My Osiris that burns. <sighs> There's just one point where it hits and the lactic acid just stays in your legs. This one's more like a fun, friendly family workout. We need to get Bible and return upon. First week was kind of not much because I just finished High Rocks at home for family, drinking, partying, and my beast. But now, two weeks in, I can feel myself catching my stride. Oh my, this is valuable. First, these workouts hurt a lot. But uh, this being the last left rep of five miles worth of speed work. I feel like a stud, like I could do almost double this distance at the same speed. But, yeah. uh, you know, fuck it. Oh. I did that last one, sub five. Last three or four or sub five. Fuck. 46 minutes of speed work. Oh. Ready for this cool down run? Let's go straight into it. 10 minute cool down, we're done. We got 131, we have one left. You know, 131? That's fasting for us. We go all out to the last one. Sip it and run it. Let's work on tired legs. Come on. Sorry. I'm ready to push it. Right when you're done, just get right into the run. Okay. You guys just jog. Oh, let's go, boys! Yeah. Woo! Oh, nice push. Nice. 131. Nice. We good? Good. All right, guys. So this is the first uh, session that you guys are going to be logging in on on YouTube over the next four or five months. Um, as we were breaking it down earlier, we did all those 400s. We were able to hit our paces. We were hitting like 85s for the first five. Then we were down below 85, down towards 80s. In the last 10, we were all always below 80 seconds, all the way down to sub five minute mile pace. All of as you can see over here, absolutely totaled, but incredible pacing. And uh, from here, we're gonna go to like a pancake shop. Uh, we may even go to the Grizzly and have the pancake challenge and I just want anyone who's watching this video understand that today starts Mustache May. That means if you're a supporter of this cause, you need to either grow or trim down to a mustache. Currently I have a handlebar, I have to go home for a funeral so I'm probably going to have to trim it up to a normal mustache, but if I wasn't, Yo, I'd, be, I'd be holding it down. For all the 40 year olds that do Hunter's program, alright, Luca, Alex, 40 year old dads, the program's still for you. All right, if you're doing this workout, what were we at, 140? 140 and then one, and then 140 and the last one, one. Yeah, one. we did 140 nonstop for the first 18. We didn't take a three minute rest, we took a one minute rest after our 10. Because the three minutes is dad's for pussies. That's dad's for, strength. For pussies. Three minutes is for pussies, yeah. all right? You know what? <laughs> 40 year old dads, 
one minute rest, all right, and then the last two, try to push, okay? We did a 135 and then we did a 120 in our last one. 131 and 121. 131, 121. Damn. That's it. It was Damn, a sprint dude, to the finish. Nice work, yeah. Dude. Getting after it. Yeah, Luca hit it hard. I thought I was going to be able to catch him on the last 50. You smoked him? He, no, no, he smoked me in the last. Oh! I, I thought you were going to catch him at the last I, I, was, I was playing the game. Yeah. That's right, boy. <laughs> I, I know that I have a good kick, but you have a good kick, too. I you told me your time on this. Yeah. yeah. Chuck it in. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, wait. oh! The heat is on, guys! Oh, shit! Go, go, go! That was, per that was a perfect pass! Let's go! I'll run the action. Get out! Oh, out of bounds, boys! That's no good. A little bit of heat. A little bit of heat out of here. Oh, man. We got orange slices. We need T.O. But I'm feeling good. I'm feeling real good. It's all about intimidation factor on this side. <laughs> I gotta be careful, dude. I'm gonna pull a hip. I already feel how tight I am from running 400s. I went like this and I was like, ooh! <laughs> Alex is out there being a, being a beast. Good go! Yeah. <laughs>